What's up everybody? So this is just gonna be a brief YouTube channel update. As you remember back in January when I came back from Atlanta, I did one to start 2018. And it was, you know, just kinda telling you how the channel was going and what I was doing. Cause during that time, I quit my job and then my laptop was, it wasn't working properly. So I couldn't record any videos for a while. And I tried to kind of fix that a little bit by just doing Twitch videos. So I would stream on Twitch and then just upload them to the YouTube channel, which was okay. But that's not the quality of videos I wanted to give you guys. I wanted to give you guys you know, my very best. So I did, I want to say maybe four or five videos that were like that. And eventually I just kind of stopped that because I figured, you know what, I would rather not put any videos on the channel than kind of give you half-ass videos. If you will, like, there's nothing wrong with uh, Twitch, um, Twitch streams and kind of using YouTube as the backlog for Twitch, but I wanted to give you guys a lot more than just that, and it was like four or five videos that was just that, you know. I didn't have a microphone, so it was just all gameplay, which isn't bad, but I want to give you more. And so, recently, you know, I got my new computer, I got the menu kind of starting back up again. Um, I started in the inside, which if you haven't watched, you should definitely check out if you're in the video games. And, uh, indie developed video games and so this is kind of another channel update to the end of the year where if you follow me on Facebook and Twitter I was talking about how I'm going to postpone the menu like it's not going anywhere like I'm not stopping it I'm not canceling it it's more of me postponing it because I haven't been uh, I haven't been able to give you guys the quality of the menu I would like like in a consistent basis and it's been kind of here and there and slightly more sporadic and my work schedule has kind of changed here and there and I just haven't been able to produce it the way that I want to. So um, episode four of season two of the menu, which if you follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and the Facebook page, you've seen the origin story before it. So it's gonna be um, Sugar Parmesan Casserole, which I'm really excited to do and I can't wait to do it. But I just haven't had the time and haven't had the time to get the ingredients and really produce it the way that I want to. So after that one, I'm just gonna postpone the menu for a little while, probably either the end of this year or early next year, just so I can come up with a better production schedule. So during that time, you're gonna get a lot more in the insight and a lot more side dish because I can do two side dish episodes in a day, depending on what I'm making. And in the insight is really easy too, because I can just kinda, I already have like a bunch of gameplay recorded, I'm recording more. So all I have to do is just chop it up and edit it and I can uh, throw it on a YouTube channel. So you'll probably end up getting a lot of in the inside, a lot of side dishes in the next coming months. That's until I can find a really good production schedule. A production schedule, excuse me, I can't talk right now, um, for the menu. So that's just kind of how the channel is going. It's going really well. Um, if also, if you follow me, one of my goals for the end of this year is to hit 100 subscribers. I'm already at 72, so I just need 28 more to hit my end of 2018 goal. And going into 2019, I'll have a new goal. So, if you haven't subscribed, come on, if this is your first time coming to Digital Chef ENT, hit the subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. You know, you help me hit my goal. You get some really great videos. I have 61 videos on the channel right now. So we have a lot of variety in games and then the food. So you just can have some variety. And I've based my YouTube channel on this concept of food and gaming, where it's not just a food channel. It's not just a gaming channel, it's this combination of the two. And you don't really see that on YouTube. You see people that cook and they do like video game themes for food. And you have people who play video games who might be eating something or they might talk about something briefly. But you don't have a YouTube channel that has a, a full-fledged cooking show and also a bunch of less plays and um, one shots of video games. So that's what I really built my channel off of. Uh, I haven't gotten this far by myself, so I want to thank everyone that subscribed and shared videos and liked videos. Even if you dislike the video, I appreciate that because it kind of gives me a gauge, you know. It goes into like the, uh, the YouTube analytics, so they kind of rank videos based on that. But I appreciate all the comments and feedbacks and likes and ideas. Like, always feel free to give me a video idea or something that you might think might help benefit the channel or something you would like me to take a look at, I'll greatly read it and take it into consideration because I want my community to be the combination of video games and food. Because food has been in video games, 
and then video games, and there's a lot of people that are in the food industry that play video games. So it's kind of already had this marriage. I'm just trying to make that bond a little stronger. So that's kind of an update for the end of 2018, I'm going into 2019. So don't worry, the menu isn't being canceled. I'm not canceling it. It's just, you know, I'm just gonna hold off on it for a little while so I can come up with a better schedule to upload it so you guys can get the menu on a more consistent basis like a normal TV show. Instead of getting it one month and then three months later and then four months, then maybe another week after that. So there's some type of consistency to it. And so thank you all for your love. Thank you all for your support. I'll be back soon with a new video. So. Stay, you know, stay tuned, stay there, and don't move a muscle, and always fight some dice and gaming. SDG is not just a motto, it's a lifestyle. So I greatly appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Check y'all out in the next video. Later.